Welcome back, everyone. And again, it's a pleasure to welcome Malik Pancholi in Los Angeles in Showbiz India. You look great. How are you doing? Yeah, I'm doing really well. It's fun to be here. It's a fun, fun little event that uh, uh, Mr. Ambani pulled together. So it's, you know, nice night. Good. Yeah. Had you met him before? I had not. I had not. It's nice to uh, meet him. It's cool that they're doing so much in the film world now. So it's, it's a cool opportunity to get to say hello, see some other Indian actors and... Um, you know, hang out, have a have a water <laughs> and some vegetarian food. <laughs> have a water. You don't drink. Well, I just feel, I just realized that I no, I just realized that I think the food here is very. Uh, it's very. You know, it's not a lot of alcohol. It's um, very vegetarian. It's it's a very nice. My mom would be very happy and proud that I'm at an event like this. So speaking about the Oscars. Yeah. Have you seen the movies? Most I've of the seen, Oscars. I've seen a fair amount of the movies. Yeah. Um, and what's your movie. what's what's your pick? Well, I th my favorite. You know, it's hard. I like so many of them this year. I thought um, I really love Jennifer Lawrence and Silver Linings Playbook and I think that she deserves to win and it seems like she might. Uh, I loved Argo, which it seems like it's going to take it, but I also love Zero Dark Thirty. Um, there were so many, so many great movies and great performances this year, so I don't know. It does feel like based on the other awards that we've seen that it, we have some pretty good predictors of what the Oscars will be like, but uh, there were a lot that I loved. I had the pleasure of interviewing you quite a few years ago in New York City, yeah. Yeah. and I remember talking to you as someone who entered the industry when there weren't so many Indians around, and now look at you look around us and there's so many Indian people who've been nominated in different categories how do you feel I think it's really I think it's really great and that's why you know what I was kind of alluding to in the beginning is it's cool that there's an event like this where people actually get to come together and honor uh, uh, people of Indian descent who are working in the industry and, and, and doing well and it's amazing that we can have an event like that as opposed to having it be like a one-person show or something you know right. so it's great it's exciting um, it's exciting and then all, all levels too you know like producing and writing and directing and all of it so it's great yeah. now let's talk about you um, you yeah. were telling me it's a different time in life for you 30 Rock is wrapped up. Is wrapped up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it was. I spent. Um, I did six of the seven seasons of that show, so it was definitely a very sad uh, goodbye. My last day of filming was was pretty heartbreaking, uh, uh, and so now on to the next, you know. But um, it was a great time. Yeah, absolutely. So, what is next for you? Uh, right now, I'm doing a lot of uh, animated work. I'm doing um, a, a Disney Channel series called Phineas and Ferb that I do a voice on. That we're in like season four now. We've done um, like a, over a hundred episodes, and uh, a new Nickelodeon series called Sanjay and Craig, and I play Sanjay, and um, Chris Hardwick plays Craig. And I think it's the first time there's been an Indian American character as like the lead on a network cartoon. So that's kind of fun. And then, you know, can continuing to pursue getting that next uh, TV show, so that's, that's kind of it. 